Here we have ESI's best-selling and most well-known product, the ESRTP4 RF Plus Wireless Program Room Thermostat. It's been in the marketplace for not far off a decade now. Just go through the unboxing, show you the parts that come within the box. We have the thermostat unit, battery to the thermostat, Stand for the thermostat if you choose to have it on the stand of course it can be wall mounted as well and then the receiver unit and if you come with me we're going to jump into the other room to go through some instructional videos for homeowners and installers setting the time and date lift the front cover and move the slider bar all the way to the far left for the time and date setting the hours will flash you can use the plus and minus buttons to amend this Press the next button, the minutes will flash. Use the plus and minus to amend this again. Again, the next button, onto the date. Next, onto the month, and next, over to the year. Finally, next, onto selecting either 12 hour or 24 hour operation. Programming. Lift the front cover and move the slider bar to the PROG position. PROG stands for program. Use the plus and minus button to select between 24 hour, which means every day will have the same programs, seven day, which means every day has to be programmed individually, and you can have different programs for the weekdays and weekends, which is the five two setting. Use the arrow button and you'll see P1, which is program one. You'll see the timer flashing. Set the time that you would like your heating to start using the plus or minus button. Then press the next button and set the temperature you want to achieve. Press the next button again and you will see P2 on the screen. This is your setback time for your heating. Use the plus and minus button to change the setback time and the next button to move to the temperature. As this is a setback time, you will generally want to set this lower than your standard on heating times. Press the next button. This is when your heating will be coming on again. P3. Up and down with the plus and minus buttons to set the time. Hit next and again we set the temperature. Follow this operational cycle until all programs are set. As there are no off settings for a programmable room thermostat, Generally speaking, the odd programs are your on for heating times and the evens are your setbacks. Amending from four to six programs. Lift the front cover of the thermostat. Make sure that the slider bar is in the off position. Hold down the A and H buttons and then tap the double arrow button. Initially, you will see the op DL start on the screen. Use the arrows and keep pressing the up button until you see code on the screen. You can press the arrow again and you'll see an error message followed shortly by programs with either the number four or six. Use the plus and minus buttons to switch between four and six programs. When you've finished, press the home button and move the slider bar back to auto. Frost protection mode. For frost protection on this unit, simply open the front cover of your thermostat and move the slider bar to the off position. You will know that it is in frost protection mode, demonstrated by the snowflake on the screen and you will see that the set temperature will show at 5 degrees. Manual mode. To enter the manual mode, open the front cover of your thermostat and move the slider bar to the MAN position for manual mode. In manual mode, you can Amend the set temperature using the plus and minus buttons and the temperature will stay as you set it until you go in and manually override this. Accessing the open therm menu. Lift the front cover of the thermostat and ensure that the slider bar is in the off position. Hold down the A and H buttons and tap on the home button with these both held down. This will take you to the open therm menu. You can then use the next button to scroll through the open therm settings. Full details of the open therm settings can be found in the manuals and instruction manuals provided with the unit. Manual override of heating via wireless receiver. 
You can manually override your heating in your home using the receiver unit as seen on screen with the manual and MA buttons. Simply pressing the manual button will put the unit into manual override mode and then you can control your heating on and off by pressing the MA button displayed by the red lights. Reconnecting the thermostat to the receiver. Our thermostats and wireless receivers will come prepared in every box. However, if the connection is ever lost, you can still repair it very easily. Simply lift the front cover of your thermostat and on your wireless receiver, hold the MA button for approximately 10 seconds until the manual button starts flashing green. When you have a green flashing light, move the slider bar to off, hold down the A, H and plus buttons until you see the green light stop flashing. Entering the technical settings. To enter the technical settings, open your thermostat front cover, move the slider bar to the off position, simply hold the A, H and double arrow buttons. This will take you into the technical menu. This is where you will find settings such as optimum start, optimum stop, delayed start, TPI and many others. For full details on these settings, please refer to the manual that is provided with each thermostat purchase. To exit the technical settings, simply press the home button and then the slider bar back to either the MAN or auto position and close the front cover.